Thinking about crossing the border for real, whether by plane, train, automobile. You're watching Simulator Sessions. My name is Maggie and I'm here with MC How. How are you doing? I'm very well, thank you. How That's are you doing? Good, good, thank you. Soy. I've been stalking you a little bit and you went back home. Oh, you know, you wouldn't be the first. <laughs> you know, I'm kind of used to that, so don't feel yeah. like embarrassed or awkward. I mean, I'm never but embarrassed. <laughs> Okay, well, so what did you find You went back home, out? right? Yeah, well, you know, I'm Australian, you know, yeah, I was born in Canberra, but yeah, yeah Tonga is yeah. the home away from home. Yeah, definitely. And um, yeah, awesome. it's very, uh, it's beautiful, yeah. you know. Every time I go there, I feel like, you know, yeah. like touching the sand and like <laughs> holding it and breathing yeah. in the air. Definitely. But yeah, it's very, it's a very spiritual kind of say, experience. I was going to say, it's quite spiritual. And yeah. even the way you guys were like cooking food with the family. Oh man, you know, and that's awesome. what Tongans do, just yeah. eat. Yeah. Eat and play football. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, but yeah, you know, it's very much part of the culture, yeah. you know, celebrating. And yeah, yeah it's, it's always awesome to go back and, and just reconnect with okay. the family and mm -hmm. your roots. And, of course. You know, and I mention it quite often, just being able to just realize how much that you do have yeah, and how you know how great you have in australia it, yeah, yeah definitely and i think that comes through with your music as well like mm. you are just like the most humblest person i think oh, you know i've ever met no. and you know it comes through <laughs> with your music which is amazing oh, i appreciate that thank yeah. you yeah i mean my father was my mum often says that you know he'll never say it but <laughs> he, he's very humble yeah. and i think i just he just leads by example, you know, he, okay. he never really said, oh, you know, you should do this, this, he yeah, just yeah. kind of, uh, yeah. and you just follow, and I'm, I'm very lucky I had a father like that. Oh, great. You know? And when you first told me you wanted to be an mm -hmm. MC, what did he say? <laughs> he was very quiet, because I, I, I was planning to play for Australia rugby, yeah. you know, and oh, I think wow. he was like, yeah, that's yeah, it, that's son, awesome. yeah. that's the goal, and then it kind of got to a point where, in order to be successful and get where I wanted to, I had to mm -hmm. pick one like music yep. or football you mm -hmm. know you had to really put that extra Focus effort on you know it. yeah mm -hmm. so and I, I was like um you know i'm doing music and yep. I, I think you kind of crushed him inside Aww. but yeah. you know he, he knew how important you know Definitely. music was to me yeah. and, and, and and again i was very fortunate to have the supportive parents yeah, of course. Definitely. You know, especially Tongan parents because you know, making a living through music. Yeah, like, I mean, I'll well, say Especially like back Asian then, parents. you know, like during, yeah, you know, <laughs> Asian parents. Yeah. And in the 90s too, yeah. it's unheard of. Yeah, you know? definitely. But I, I kind of think that they were like, well, it could be a phase of yeah, just yeah. supporting, see, how, see how, it how it goes. Yeah, but, yeah. you know. That's the, great. Yeah, they've been great. You know, they come to the shows. Oh, and, cute. Yeah. So are they yelling out at you and like screaming? Or oh, dad's the one who's just chilling in the back, you know. Mum's the one that's like waving. Oh, cute. Yeah. And you've obviously been in saying for like a long, long time. Yeah. And it seems like everything is just falling into place for you now. Like you're launching something soon. You're going on tour with Remy, right? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I, just, yeah I think it, it is just a result of, you know, a lot of people say, oh, man, hard how work. do you do it? Yeah, it's definitely yeah. hard work yeah, is a part of it. But, yeah. you know, there's also th other things that people don't really tell you mm -hmm. in order to be successful. You really do have to be kind of selfish. Yeah. You know, stubborn. Okay. You know, people don't tell you like, oh, yeah. man, you know, it's not really a career. And he's like, no, nah, I've got this, you know, I know what I want to yeah, do. Yeah, of course. Uh, I mean, I've, I've known what I wanted to do since high school. So yeah. I'm, I'm fortunate I got to recognize that, you know, Definitely. a lot of people, Take they go to uni time. and yeah. the end of uni, they're still like, I didn't even know what I want to yeah, do. Yeah, definitely. So you have to be kind of stubborn and selfish, mm -hmm. you know, to achieve these things. But, yeah. you know, hopefully at the end of the day, you kind of achieve yeah, some sort of success. Of course. I couldn't imagine you being like selfish or well, stubborn. you know, not, not, not so much in a bad way, yeah, but yeah, but just knowing what you want. Yeah, you yeah. know, it's like um, you kind of just looking out for yourself mm -hmm. because you're just so focused in, in what yeah. you want to achieve, and yeah. and you know, and sometimes you're like kind of you know not neglect, mm -hmm. but you kind of shy away from you know people, you yeah, know, yeah, because you're just so focused. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, I mean, they, they kind of saw the bigger picture as well. So yeah, they're like, oh, you know, cool. Oh, that's great. Mm. So, and how do you feel just with everything that's going yeah, on? Yeah, I, I, again, so I, just, I just feel very fortunate that I'm, yeah. um, you know, because like I said, I, I've been wanting to do music yeah, since high school. So mm -hmm. we're talking like 92. So yeah. we're in 2015. And mm -hmm. I'm still, you know, I host the radio show. I'm yeah. still going on tour, still mm -hmm. releasing music. Yeah. And, I, and, you know, it just is hard work and dedication and, as cliche as it sounds, mm -hmm. passion. You Definitely. know what I mean? I still have, you know, I still get new 
and, and just because I'm an older head as well. Yeah. You know, a lot of people my age go, oh man, hip hop wasn't like, you know, it was back in the days, <laughs> like in 87. Like, well, we're not yeah. in 87, of we're course. not in 93. Definitely. They're my favorite eras, but yeah. there's still awesome music coming out of course. now. I yeah. feel like hip hop is in, in, you know, in its best place since that golden era, okay. you know, the last That's three good. years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Awesome. And for Australia as well, you think? Yeah, in Australia as well, you know, um, when I was coming up, there was pretty much only like one scene. Um, yeah, of course. And, yeah. you know, it's probably like five people at a show. <laughs> and they were all guys. <laughs> you knew them all. <laughs> yeah, I knew them all. One of them was my dad. No, um, uh, and yeah, just people are now comfortable with what they're doing. Yeah. You know, that they, they don't feel like they have to, you know, sound like this or Not that. Not limited anymore. Yeah, mm. you know, and there's little pockets of scenes, you know. Yeah. And sometimes those scenes don't, meet they just got yeah, their own thing happening true. like yeah. you got tk doing yeah. a kind of the, the up tempo mm -hmm. um mia type of yeah, thing yeah. and then you got remy doing mm -hmm. the sort of slum village thing yeah. and then you have people like gecko just the underground new yorky kind of mm -hmm. hip-hop so i think yeah it's yeah. really flourishing and yeah it's a beautiful moment oh good that's good and your no end theory yeah. tell us about that uh yeah i just i released a vinyl um like sample ep mm -hmm four tracks on record store day a couple oh, of weeks yes, ago yes. and um it, it's it's almost celebrating vinyl of yeah, course yeah, and for the vinyl heads mm -hmm. but also it was like a, a a sneak preview of what the album yeah definitely it will be which will be coming out hopefully july we're okay. thinking yeah um but yeah the, the, on vinyl as well or just um be on everything, I, I, I think so you know yeah. there'll be cd digital maybe even mm -hmm. cassette who knows oh, you know, nice. you know, laser disc yeah or, yeah mini disc or something i don't know yeah USB. everything yeah usb <laughs> smoke signals um but yeah i mean the title of the no one theory is an yeah. obvious yeah, kind of yes. homage to a tribe called quest yeah, low end theory so mm -hmm. it kind of sets the tone of where i'm what from and like, yeah, yeah. And, and no end obviously is like infinity mm -hmm. uh, for the passion i have for for music and yeah. love and family and life yeah, yeah. Definitely. Really deep stuff. You yeah, know, so. but that's exciting. That's what we <laughs> want to hear. Yeah, you know, yeah. I just feel, especially, you know, I'm, I'm 39 years old, right? yeah. but I still, I feel invigorating, you know, mm -hmm. when I hang out with people like Remy, who's like, yeah. just turned 23. Yeah, yeah, And, yeah. and Barrow has just turned, yeah. I think, just 18. <laughs> But for me, it's invigorating, you know, yeah. I, can't, I, I feed off their energy. Definitely. And they kind of appreciate my experience. Yeah, so, of course. So it's just a great mix. Yeah, it's good because you're just kind of bonding with each other with the same mutual respect. Yeah. The same music. Exactly. But just different, I guess. Exactly. Not genres, but I guess subcultures. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mm. So you're going on tour with Remy. Yeah. Yeah. What's that going to be like for you? Uh, a lot of fun. Yeah. Because yeah. he's, he's a lot of fun to, um, to hang out with mm -hmm. and he's producer, DJ, yeah. mm -hmm. uh, Sensible J. Mm -hmm. Who's, who's like around my age, so they got a really good chemistry <laughs> nice. of sort of youth and experience yeah. and I yeah. think that's why it really works with okay. them and, yeah. and why Remy kind of has, has a good knowledge of, of music as yes. well as has the youth mm -hmm. on his side. Yeah, and, um, definitely. Yeah, just be a lot of fun, just a lot of funky music yeah. and great vibes. Nice. Yeah. And what other projects are you working on now? Um, besides that, well, I'm, I'm DJing as well and, mm -hmm. and, and hosting things and yeah. So yeah, just just really not trying to limit myself yeah, definitely. to things, you know. Yeah. I, you know, I think when you're younger, you're kind of like, oh, I just want to rap. That's yeah. all I want to do is mm -hmm. rap. Give me a yeah. beat. I want to rap. <laughs> but you know, you get older and you kind of experience things. You travel yeah, and you just, your mind you becomes keep open. You've got options open, I think. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, it's such a big world, and you know, yeah. you don't know what you are going to gravi yeah. gravitate towards next. Definitely. So I'm just always trying to do something mm -hmm. you know involving music yeah definitely and i guess it challenges you as an artist as well obviously expanding and learning mm. different kind of things yeah and cool. you know i feel that i still you know i still hold it on the mic you know so <laughs> uh, you know i just love making music you know yeah, i love definitely. singing love rapping awesome. yeah cool well i'm very look forward to your no end theory one i think that's going to be awesome yeah i think it'll be yeah. the album of 2015 yeah. no, totally. <laughs> no. <laughs> it'll be my favorite album anyway yeah. and probably my parents yeah. as well and your dad so yeah. that's okay that's all that <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> number one fans yeah. <laughs> thanks so much for coming man through. my pleasure really thank appreciate you it. thanks maggie thank you. You're watching Simone Sessions, my name is Maggie. So try not to put a foot wrong, disrespect the people and the land that you walk on. No, the more I see, the less I know. And yeah, that's for sure. Now what I'm gonna do is start to explore, so baby, tell it you wind up your head.